with 68% of land being prone to drought and 65% of water reservoirs reporting below normal water levels, Gram Vikas has risen as an example in managing productive forests and empowering forest-dependent communities. We dug 10 by 10 feet WAT, that is water absorption trenches. After we dug the trenches, the runoff rainwater flows down at great speed and flows directly into the trenches. This way, the runoff water does not reach the lowest level but is contained in the trenches and seeps into the ground. Gram Vikas, which translates to village development, has been working for the well-being of Adivasi and marginalized communities in inaccessible rural areas since 1979. We mobilized the communities to address this issue, which required them to uh, make changes in the way they took up agriculture, the way they treated their forest land, the way they handled slope land. We were able to mobilize them and help them with technology and knowledge inputs and bring them together on common platforms at the village level to take up steps to rejuvenate their water sources. Their vision is an equitable and sustainable society where people live in peace with dignity. Gram Vikas has fostered partnerships with village institutions and communities. Restoration of forest ecosystems has contributed to rejuvenation of water sources and enhanced the carbon sequestration potential. Continued promotion by Gram Vikas of intercropping in the plantation land with oil seeds and pulses has helped in generating additional income and sustaining the livelihood of farmers and Adivasis. Right now, cashew is being sold at 100 rupees a kilo in my village. In our village, if all of us are united and think alike to care for the trees planted by Gram Vikas, then we can hope to earn 50,000 rupees a year. The trees have grown big and are bearing fruits which are being sold now.